everybody, welcome back. Unboxing time. Mary's here. Hello. And we're here to open up the May 2018 My Geek Box. <laughs> So uh, this is one of the couple of boxes that I do get sent for free, just letting you guys know. They aren't paying me for a review or anything, but they do give me the box for free. However, if you would like to check out this box, I have a link in the description below. Should give you guys a nice little discount, and it's just good for everybody all around if you like this one. So this is from Across the Pond? Yep, that's why it has all this extra crap on it, and you know, <laughs> you can barely see the box, but. Okay. Um, this one's been a little bit hit or miss lately. This and Z-Box, you know, they've, they've, some have been cool, some have been kind of lacking. I'm wondering if they're just going through a phase, like a lot of boxes do, of now, not being great. Now, did they do a thing? Mm, I can't remember. No, not really. Um, I think we got a wallet, some oddly shaped things, t-shirt, I'll do the t-shirt. Alright. Ooh, I kind of already like it, I don't know what it is yet, but I still don't, okay, it's gonna be gaming, I think, boob? Noob! Noob, noob yeah. killer! Sword That's actually kind of cool. Controller. Yeah. I kind of like that design, although I am by no means a noob killer, I am the noob that gets killed. Same here. <laughs> However, boobs, on the other hand, are just nice. I, I have nothing else to say about that. Uh, but I like the colors, I like the designs. Um, yeah, actually that's pretty cool. I guess it's supposed to be some kind of made up controller. I guess kind of PlayStation. Yeah, yeah, a little pointy. Mm. That's pretty cool, so I wonder if this is gonna be a game themed box. I mean, they don't do like named themes, but I, maybe they kind of do thematic packagings. I'm not really sure. We, we gonna find out. For how long? <laughs> well, sometimes they change too. You know, I think they did themes uh, originally. Is this just the card for? Oh, that's the card for. Yeah, we'll here. just toss that down the bottom. Okay, let's see. Um, I'll grab the wallet feeling thing. Okay. It is a wallet. It, it is, is a wallet. Black Panther wallet. It's a Black Panther wallet. We got a Thor one, just like that recently. I think. Maybe. Oh, and it's, you might want to show them, show them the, the thing oh, there, yeah. too, because that was supposed to be attached, but... Yeah. So, that's supposed to be attached. And here is the actual wallet. Uh, the detail is... you got to really be looking at it, and there's like, it says Black Panther made in Wakanda around it, but you've got to really oh, yeah, you catch it like, right, like... Up close. Um... So there's the inside, basic, you know, bifold. And, and I have little Black Panther symbols in the lining there. I have to do this. I hate to do the direction in the video, but please don't do it piece by piece every time. That's a cut I have to search for and then find the right frame to cut on. Like I ask, please show the whole thing all at once in one go. Oh. <laughs> No, again, you have nothing to apologize All things, for. I didn't know what I was showing without, I was like, oh, there's a thing, and there's another thing, and then, oh, there's another thing. You don't have to make, ex you know, you don't have to say you're sorry or make excuses. I'm just asking politely. Yeah, dude. Otherwise, I'm not me. That's fair. We've had that conversation a lot. Like, you know, like even if we're filming stuff, I'll be like, well, can you do it this way? She's like, I'm sorry. I'm like, no, it's, it's not apologizing. <laughs> Uh, I do think this is game themed. I think we have a pint sized hero. We have one of the mystery minis that feels like the arcade cabinets, and then I have no idea what this big thing is, so. Okay, well. I'm gonna pull out the mystery mini that feels like an arcade cabinet, because these typically kind of tell you what they are mm. based on what the box is, most part. Kubert. Kubert? I have a Kubert. Um, I don't know if Coily will open it here, but let me go ahead and take the plastic off. A little less reflective when I show y'all what we're looking at. So, you already have a Kubert? I have Kubert. I'm 99% sure. Okay. But boom. See, I love that they come like the arcade cabinets. Mm-hmm. I do think that's really neat. I've always appreciated that design. However, I do wish these, I get it though, like they want to make each one look like a different arcade cabinet, you know, relative to the figures and stuff. And I like that, but at the same time, I wish they were a little more mystery and blind, like most mystery minis. So, but you could be getting a coil though. That's what I'm thinking. That's why I'm going to go ahead and open it. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Come on, come on. Uh, it's definitely Hubert. I'm just looking at <laughs> The centipede on the back kind of looks like Shinlon. Oh, you know what? I don't have this Hubert. <laughs> I must have the pop. I wasn't sure if I had the pop or the mystery mini. Yeah. But uh, 
What's that, Hubert? Boom. We'll put. Nope. We can't do that. My bad. Um. So here you go. Here's Hubert. Look, he's all sad. He's all boop. Um. Not a lot. Not a lot of detail going on. But he is really cute. Does he stand? Yeah, he stands pretty well. Um. Yeah. Centipede though. Does it not look kind of like Shinron? It does, and I do have that one. Okay. But it does. You're right. That looks a lot like Shinron. <laughs> All right, well, that's pretty cool. You know, I mean, depending on what the other things are, this box could still be pretty good. Okay. Uh, I'll pull out the pint size. Okay. And it's oh, a Guardians of the Galaxy. Did you, Volume 2. Did you, did you get this? Some. Okay. But there's plenty I'm missing. All right, so here we go. These are... I don't think I ever actually saw these. Yeah, these are commons. I know I've done some Walgreens ones. Okay, open now or? Sure, let's just go ahead and do it. Let's, yeah, if can you want to try and feel. Uh, with, it's, I don't know, you can if you want to try, but I find the pint size heroes typically kind of difficult yeah, to. Yeah, I can't. And there's also like paper in there that'll show oh, up. Oh, that, that's. That's part of why, yeah. yeah. Okay, so we got a uh, oh, Drax. Drax. I don't know if I got him or not. I don't think so. So, there you go. Because I didn't get that many of these, and he's one in 12. Boom, haha, <laughs> I did that in a way that maybe I don't have to add a cut. <laughs> I like how they tried to put all of his tattoos nice. on, but it's a bit of a mess. <laughs> yeah, at that size, yeah, that's a little bit difficult uh, to do. But you know, actually, you know, I feel like he would be cuter than that. I feel like <laughs> you could give him more of a smile, a little less demonic eyes. And he has a smile. I, I mean, like, more of one, I don't know. You might like boom. Yeah, I kind of want something more like that. Yeah, I want like the Dorb style. Uh, um, this might be like a glass or a couple of, I don't know. It's kind of heavy. Oh, it is a tumbler. Oh, ooh, oh, color change though. You know what that means. Um, oh. Now, okay. <laughs> Hold on, let's just make sure there's nothing else. Ooh, bye, Cubert. <laughs> nothing else in the box. So let me just show you the box first. And you know I love Star Wars. I love Kylo. Now, also, you may know, last times we've been getting these glasses, I was kind of complaining in terms of not really something I have a use for or that I use or whatever. Um, that's changed. Because I really like having my beer in a tumbler glass, you know? So <laughs> I'm actually using most of those. And some of the ones that say machine wash only, like that Black Panther one, if I put it on the top rack, totally fine. This, however, might be a problem because of the color changing. But you know what? I'm gonna do the same system. I'll top rack it, and if it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But it's my boy Kylo, and I'm excited. Oh, that's a nice one, too. So if it gets, is it hot or cold activated? I don't know. Let's see, uh, does it say on the back? Uh... Not suitable for a dishwasher or a microwave. Well, we'll find out. But yeah, check out that Kylo. And for light best saber. color change results, wash with warm water to set product to room temperature, then fill with ice cold water. Okay. So apparently it's a cold change. Good, because ice cold beer is going in this bad boy. I have a nice Ninja Turtle one, and a Stan Lee one, and a Black mm -hmm. Panther one, and now I have a Kylo. That's really cool. Oh, I guess the back color changes too. Oh yeah, it's gonna, yeah, the red will show up on the First Order mm -hmm. logo and everything. Very, very cool. Actually, I'm actually really happy with this box. I was a little bit worried when I was first feeling in it, but I like everything in it. The shirt is maybe the, the weakest element, and it's actually pretty cool. You know, I've got a nice little Cubert wherever he went. Yeah. I guess he's Cuberting around somewhere. <laughs> awesome glass that now I love. And you know, I mean, it's like with the socks. When we were first getting socks, I couldn't stand it. I'm like, ugh. But then I fell in love with them. So it happens with these things. Yep, so we have a card. Let's see. With an interesting art. At Mark Bell Illustration. Huh. All right. Nice. And then, of course, we have all the stuff on the back for May. With my Geekbox t-shirt, the Black Panther wallet. Oh, I guess the wallet was the weak thing. I already forgot about it. Yeah. I forgot it was even in there for me. But uh, I definitely don't see me changing over in wallets. Oh, so we could have gotten the retro video game toy or the BB-8 Last Jedi print. So he's probably happier with the toy. I am. Even though I love Last Jedi, I love BB-8. But I just, again, Prince, other than his music, I'm not up now. <laughs> I make that joke way too often. Um... But yeah, no, actually, I am happy with that because I, I prefer little toys over art mm -hmm. prints. If I'm going to get an art print, I want it on the front of a comic book or on a DVD box or slip cover. That's kind of how I feel about that now. 
Um, you did. Sh I wasn't paying attention. I did. Yeah, you did. I okay. Yeah, yeah. I did the thing. I know you did the thing. You did it well. And um, yeah, so there you guys go. That's the May Geek Box, my Geek Box. So if you want to check them out, like I said, I got a link. That one was really solid for me, so quite happy with that. Mm -hmm. But what about you guys? Are you excited for that? Man, she's got the goosebumps. I thought it was warm in here. Uh, <laughs> are you guys excited for it? What was your favorite item? What did you get in yours? Um, all that kind of stuff. That's because I, I assume you could have gotten any of the retro video games mystery minis. Yep. Mm -hmm. And uh, geek out with us in the comments. We'd like to hear what you guys have to say. Drunken movie night this Friday, baby. Woo! <laughs> Are you gonna be there? Let me hear it. I don't know what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, we're watching Asylum movies. That's always a good time, we're watching movies from the Asylum. But uh, yeah, so come on by 7 p.m. Eastern this Friday, June 1st, 2018. Click the thumbs up button, give us that good old thumb of encouragement. We do love to be encouraged. I'm sorry we're back from an awesome Indian meal. And uh, I guess we're gonna get out of here. Mm -hmm. Go open up some more stuff. We'll see you all later.